I was like, man, you know, you're still 36. You're young. You're in shape. Save the day. Let's go get paid. Let's have fun. You're fighting a legend. And uh, what 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 do I have to lose? We'll see. And it's just, you know, I know I'm nearing the end of my career soon. And this, I think it's win-win for me because if I go in there and I can finish and beat RDA, a former champ, then it gives me a lot of selling points to be getting these bigger fights, which seem to have been eluding me in the top five of the lightweight division here in the UFC. And how do you not give me something big after this if I go in there after stepping up? And, uh, you know, if it doesn't go my way, then I, I, I saved the day and I'm going in there to try to win. So we'll see. It's a lot of things, right? And they come, things come and go. So when I first agreed to it, I was like, yes, like I'm stepping up. This is crazy. Then there was remorse or not remorse, like regret. And what am I doing? I, I started feeling like I was having an anxiety attack. And then I went and hit pads and got a really hard workout in and sweat and just felt that, that fire again. I felt hyped up. I was picturing the fight. I was picturing him. And then, you know, you get more regret in the car, you're drinking water and you got to pee and it's, uh, it's been back and forth and it'll probably be that way up until I leave the uh, octagon in the apex. And any one of these little melody fools can